Okay, you've heard of the phrase, Rome wasn't built in a day. Mm -hmm. Well, neither was a Richmond Park. But it did get rebuilt in a day. NBC Bay Joe Rosetta Jr. shows us how a community labored to beat the clock. And we built it! There are things in life that take time. And we built it! But for a South Richmond Park that fell on hard times. A heartache for a while. Salvation needed just a day. And we build it today. And we are rebuilding this seven acre park in South Richmond, trying to restore it to its former glory. We have some other trees that are gonna get planted. Pink, magenta. We're trying to build this park in a day. The city of Richmond and the Trust for Public Land put out a call for volunteers to help rebuild Kennedy Park. I realize how much work goes in putting these things together. <laughs> On Saturday, a lot of folks, they came. The last count I heard was 375 people. I see a community coming together to make a change that's been needed for a lot of years. Volunteers from across the Bay Area carried out some 25 projects simultaneously. We're painting a community mural. We have 50 trees being planted on the street. We have people who are planting rose gardens over here. Footprints marked a new safe route for kids. Richmond Mayor Tom Butt celebrated the new outdoor fitness area with a ribbon cutting. A ribbon cutting. That's a ribbon cutting. You, you see a lot of these people we've never seen before who came out because they have an interest in this park. When you're painting, you don't want to just have it going all over the place. Park neighbor Michelle Dupre Gaines put 37 years experience as a Caltrans bridge painter to work. Just like that. Look at this. Trees going up. I think it will give us a chance to actually come out and appreciate all of this land that's just been sitting here dormant. In one corner, volunteers carved out a dirt bike track. In another, they installed picnic tables. Everyone, it seemed, was pitching in. There's a whole bunch of more stuff to do now, so it's going to bring more people out. It's a change. Change is coming. A change is coming. And in a park that hasn't seen much love in decades, change was welcome. So I think it's going to bring a whole lot of camaraderie to the neighborhood. By the afternoon, the new Kennedy Park was already getting its first tryout. It's cool. At the end of the day, you have a new park. It was a single day that changed more than just a single park. In a way, it seemed to change a neighborhood. This neighborhood should just feel good this morning. Joe Rosado Jr., NBC Bay Area News. Everyone's, it looks fabulous. Yeah, and you notice everyone smiles yes. when they're at the park. That thing, the teeter-totter <laughs> was fun. It looked great. And it was a nice day outside for it too, Jeff.